Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel and to answer a question that I've got a few times from some viewers that are intrigued with some websites they visit and that the browser in the address bar says not secure. So here this website says it in Google Chrome. It also says the same thing in my Microsoft Edge browser. What does it mean exactly and is it dangerous to visit such a site? It all depends on what the site is all about. Of course, it'd be preferable if all websites had security or encrypted security. What this means is that this website, instead of using HTTPS for encrypted security, is using, using plain HTTP. So between you and the server where this information is coming from, there's no encryption. Anybody in the middle would be able to view whatever is being sent on this um, website and uh, from you and from the website. Now, in some cases, like this case, I don't really mind because this website is a very simple website that has only lists of uh, text broadcasts that I like to uh, check out from time to time. There's no sensitive information in here, and it never asks you for anything uh, sensitive also. So that's not of a big problem when it's like that. Uh, the problem would be if the non-secure website would ask you for personal information. Then this would become dangerous, as it is not a good idea to give personal information on a non-secure website, since everybody can see what's happening in between you and the computer in general. So usually what happens is, so here if we look into uh, Google Chrome, which is the most br uh, important browser, you can click on it. It's going to tell you that it's you know uh, not secure and not to enter any sensitive information. If, like I said, it's something not that much of you know, you know anything uh, important or anything that is sensitive, it doesn't matter too much that it's not especially if you have no information to enter in here. In Google Chrome, they give you the possibility to go to the site settings and you can actually set rules. So you can actually uh, use you know, uh, a blocker, block some of the permissions, block some of the information in here that are uh, with this website if you wish to make it more secure. Like I said, it's not too much of a problem as long as you're not entering personal information. And it really has most to do with the fact that the site is not using HTTPS, like most websites are today, actually. On uh, Edge here, for example, you could see that you can um, actually make sure that the tracking prevention is on and all of that information. That also helps a lot. For the rest, um, it is eventually going to be mandatory that these websites are secure because at some point these websites will actually need uh, to have a certificate because at some point the browsers will not allow any unsecure websites to go through so it's a question of time between a bit, you know between now and and some period of time i, I don't know if there's a time frame actually where HTTPS will be the only uh, protocol to use because it's encrypted. But uh, like I said, not entering any personal information, not to worry too much about this. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.